All right, in this review, I will be unboxing and reviewing the uh, rechargeable stereo bomb speaker. And it's compatible with iPhone, iPod, Samsung Galaxy, uh, MP3 players, Mac, PC, stereo, CD, gaming. Look on the back. Package contents. Specifications. Um, so let's go ahead and and I only got it for six bucks. Uh, so we'll see what the quality's like and uh, we'll test it out. Do a little review. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and open it. All right. Now that I got it open, here's the little bomb. It has a on off on the bottom. There's where you plug in the uh, USB cable to it to charge it. Here is the uh, MIDI jack that um, plugs into the, uh, the appliance, whatever you're using. There's a little bomb. I'm going to go ahead and get my um, iPod and we'll give it a check and see how it sounds. Okay, so we've got my iPod here. And we're going to go ahead and plug it into the top. Plug it in there. We'll go ahead and turn it on. The little light comes on to let you know that it's on. And let's give a listen. See if it's worth um, $6. I think it's growth spurt for video games. Oh, can totally. you, look, you look at it. 1990, right? You had, like, it was Sega Genesis. The Super Nintendo hadn't just come out yet, right? You had the NES. And you had like 99 with a Dreamcast. It sounds huge, pretty good. It's not too bad. I mean, it's... And then look, compare like 2000 to 2010. It muffles, but I mean... Not as much. It's, it's not there's a... a uh, speaker. There's a photo on like some of the tech sites that show the growth of polygons. So and that's not bad for... Like uh, you mentioned there, where... For six the bucks. 90s, you know, I mean, it does... You can barely crank out... It does pretty well. You know, 100 or 500 polygons per character. And so you had these characters that had these really weird angles. And they, it looked like they had mitts for yeah, hands. I'm pretty happy with the $6 yeah, yeah. purchase. And I mean, it, at the end of the decade, it's not too bad. And being rechargeable, that's that's pretty good. So I give this a thumbs up. I mean, if you can find these. I found this at Big Lots. Um, I mean, if you can... If you can find these for six dollars, I'd say go ahead and buy it. If you only want it for to listen to podcasts, um, or the reason why I got it is because I made a game, little gaming That's system, and I want to uh, use this with my little gaming system. So that's the reason why I I purchased this one. Um, so yeah, I'd say go ahead and, and buy it. It's a it's not a bad little purchase for six bucks.